Hey guys, huddle up! It's time for another Around the Storage Block Chalk Talk, and today we're going to look at the HPE 3 Store StoreServe 8000 family. Would you be surprised if I told you that most data today sits on legacy storage, which was designed over 20 years ago, and that forces silos of information. Take EMC, for example. In the high end, they have VMAX, which is very scalable and resilient, but it's complex and costly. In the mid-range, they have VNX, which is affordable, but forces trade-offs between scalability and performance. And since neither VMAX or VNX is optimized for flash, they had to buy Extreme IO, which delivers the performance, but it hasn't been battle-tested and lacks a lot of key features. And then they try to tie this all together by using a hardware appliance called VPlex for data mobility, which adds more risk and complexity. So what you get is a bunch of different solutions with little to no cross-family interoperability. The result of this is a very complex, expensive, and rigid infrastructure which is unsustainable. The average customer sees around 30% utilization, meaning most capacity is trapped and unavailable for use. No business or government on the planet would stand for wasting 7 out of 10 dollars they spend. Yet that's exactly what they're doing with legacy storage today. HPE has a different strategy with a single architecture for mid-range, enterprise, and all flash storage with a common management. And our HPE 3 Store StoreServe 8000 family consists of four different models, and all can start in a small 2U form factor, and all are powered by the same flash-optimized architecture. This means any 8000 model can deliver all flash performance. Our converged flash portfolio is ideal for customers that are not quite ready to go all flash. Maybe they want all flash performance, but the flexibility to add spinning media. And unlike traditional hybrid arrays, the 8200, the 8400, and the 8440 were designed for flash. This means they treat SSDs very differently from spinning media. You can leverage SSDs as an extension of cache for near all flash performance with adaptive flash cache. Or you can leverage SSDs for a hot tier of data with adaptive optimization. Or you can do a combination of both. The 8450 is our all flash solution when you know you want to stick with all flash. But what really separates us from the rest of the startups is the mature set of data services that we bring to the table. So you get a no compromises, data center proven architecture that delivers accelerated flash performance and features like thin deduplication and thin provisioning for data efficiency, quality of service to assure service levels, non-disruptive data mobility for data center agility, and the most complete set of disaster recovery options in the industry. So what are we delivering with HPE 3 Store StoreServe 8000 family? It starts with affordability. When our customers transition from legacy storage, on an average, they can reduce their footprint by more than 75%. Next is performance. In a flash world, this is a given, but we're the only ones that can do it with no compromises. Resiliency sometimes gets overlooked in a flash world, but how fast is an all-flash system that's down or missing a controller? Unlike a VNX or pure storage, the 3PAR 8000 scales up to four controllers to deliver predictable performance even in a failure scenario. And finally, it has to be simple. The 8000 series allows you to effortlessly grow in any direction. But all you have to do is remember these three numbers. 19,000. That's all it takes to step into an all-flash system. 1 million. Whether you go converged flash or all-flash, that's the amount of IOPS you can push all at sub-millisecond latencies. And 5.5. That's the amount of petabytes you can scale to a single floor tile. So how do we match up with the competition? Our All Flash 8450 packs the best punch right from the start. What we mean by this is that it's a 2U configuration. The 8450 can scale up to 280 terabytes of usable capacity. Pure storage new M70 needs 7U, and Extreme IO needs 4 bricks and 23U to get to that same capacity. That's a lot more space. Never mind the limited resiliency and missing data services that those two startups have. Or maybe you're going to want to optimize on cost and go with the lowest all-flash entry point of $19,000. Pure and Extreme are going to be a little bit more expensive than that. So no matter what your requirement is, we've got you covered with the HPE 3 Par Store Serve 8000 series. So to wrap this up, HPE 3 Par is the only solution in the market that can deliver all-flash performance without any compromises. Legacy guys like EMC VNX may be affordable, and yeah, they can scale a bit, but they choke on flash and offer limited performance. And the flash startups like Extreme IO and Pure Storage are fast, but they're only solving point-in-time issues. They can't scale, they're not proven, and with no native data mobility, they're just isolated flash silos. 
So remember, over 1 million IOPS, less than $1.50 per usable gigabyte, over 7 petabytes in a single system, zero recovery point objective, end-to-end -end data integrity, and one-click data mobility. All flash with no compromises means being able to do all of this, not just some of it. You can learn more about HPE 3PAR at hpe.com forward slash storage forward slash 3PAR. You can find me on Twitter as Calvin Zito, and you can find our blog at hpe.com forward slash storage forward slash blog. Thanks for joining me.